Get ready, because what you're about to see is not a robot. Today, you're about to meet a humanoid machine built for raw strength, extreme movement, and full-scale disruption. This isn't a concept. This isn't CGI. This is the Engine IT800, a $50,000 powerhouse designed for speed, impact, and high dynamic environments where failure is not an option. Before you watch what this machine can actually do, ask yourself one question. What happens when robots become strong enough to replace humans in the toughest jobs on the planet? Let's find out. Most humanoid robots are built for balance, mobility, and careful movement. The T800 was built for something else entirely. Power, speed, and absolute durability. Branded as a hardcore evolution and born to disrupt. This machine was engineered to perform where standard robots simply break down or freeze. With a height of 1.73 meters and a total weight of just 75 kilograms, including its battery, the T800 is surprisingly lean. But don't let the size fool you. Inside that aviation-grade magnesium aluminium alloy shell is a torque system capable of a jaw-dropping 450 newton meters. 450, that's not normal. That's extreme. So how does a robot this compact generate this much force? It starts with the structural frame, a lightweight alloy chosen specifically to handle high-impact stress. Then comes the active cooling modules integrated into the leg joints. These allow the T800 to maintain peak output even when performing moves that would cause most robots to overheat. And inside the chest cavity, its compute system is built around an 8-core processor. But the Pro and Max versions can be upgraded to a Thor chip, delivering up to 2,000 tops. Yes. 2000. At that level, the robot isn't just reacting, it's predicting. And later in this video, you're going to see why that matters. One of the biggest challenges in humanoid robotics is environmental awareness. The T800 solves this with a complete 360-degree LiDAR system paired with dual RealSense depth cameras. This gives it millisecond-level spatial understanding. In simple terms, it sees almost everything, all the time. This is the kind of tech people send to their friends like, bro, look what they're making now. Now let's talk movement because this is where the T800 breaks the rules. With 43 degrees of freedom, the robot can deliver motions that look almost unreal. Flying kicks, capoeira spins, precise boxing combos, rapid directional changes, and standing recovery after impact. It doesn't hesitate, it doesn't wobble, it just moves. And thanks to its top speed of 3 meters per second around 6.7 miles per hour, it can sprint fast enough for logistics, security, and high-demand mobility tasks. But raw power means nothing if the hands can't handle the details. So each hand on the T800 comes with 7 degrees of freedom and tactile sensing. This gives the robot the ability to perform delicate tasks, lift up to 5 kilograms per hand, and interact with tools and objects naturally, strong enough for heavy work. Precise enough for detailed work. The T800 is in a test model. It's already being targeted for real deployments. 1. Logistics. Fast, strong, accurate, perfect for repetitive multi-shift tasks. 2. Hotels. Guidance, delivery, routing, and emergency support. 3. Retail. Navigation assistance, restocking, and crowdflow management. 4. Factory collaboration. Working alongside humans where safety, speed, and torque matter. We're entering a world where machines like this don't just support us. They stand next to us. One question always appears when people see a humanoid robot this strong. Can it fight? Here's the surprising answer. It's not built for violence, but it is built for high dynamic motion that looks like martial arts. Flying kicks, evasive spins, high torque punches, these movements aren't for combat, they're for training balance, stability, and response timing. This is the moment people clip and send everywhere. Let's run through the raw numbers because these don't lie. Height, 1.73 meters. Weight, 75 kilograms with battery. Degrees of freedom, 43 total. Max torque, top speed, 3 meters per second. Battery, 72 volt solid state pack. Runtime 2 to 4 hours. Compute up to 2,000 tops with the Thor chip. Perception, full 360 LiDAR plus dual depth cameras. When numbers get this serious, one thing becomes clear. Humanoid robots are entering their performance era. So after everything you've seen today, what does a machine like this actually mean for the future? It means the era of slow, fragile humanoids is over.
It means robots built for real-world impact are officially here. And it means companies are no longer asking if they'll adopt humanoids, they're asking when. The Engine i T800 starting at $50,000 shows just how fast things are moving. If you want more deep dives like this, more future tech breakdowns, and more next-generation robotics, make sure you follow along, because this channel is just getting started. Drop a comment about the one feature that surprised you the most, and I'll feature the best replies in the next upload. And if you want to see the most extreme tech before anyone else, hit subscribe, and welcome to Future Tech Zone.